And this poem I first heard John Kenyuk reciting at uh, uh, Hunt the Wren party at our house uh, many years ago. It's I the Moon. The clouds drew back their curtains from the moon, and once again silver light shone down, illuminating mountain, tree, and field, castle and cottage, farmstead, village town. Yet that same moon, impassive, quiet, and cold, if she could speak, would wondrous tales unfold. For I was old when Snaefell's mighty head rose layer by layer from Neptune's vast domain, when Vulcan's fires helped forge the scarlet rocks and the melting ice laid down the northern plain. I watched the corals grow when seas were warm and saw the stones for castle Russian form. Night after night, I watched the wind and the rain work on the rocks and grind them into soil. I saw this isle become soft and fresh and green, and man come to commence his endless toil. My tides washed gently on the sand. Peaceful it seemed, at last, this land. But I was wrong. Once more the island shook, not with earthquake, but with war and strife, as from the north the dread invader came, and Manxman paid for freedom with his life. Yet was the conqueror conquered, not by arms, but by this island's richness and its charms. I saw the fate of each succeeding race. They came to conquer, but themselves were caught. Because I saw this land of freedom born, none hold it long, be it bartered, won, or bought. They seek possession, but desert their former ranks, and in a little while cry, we are Manx. Thus did I see this tiny nation grow, and yet no matter where I light the earth, there do I see the sons of man proclaim with heartfelt pride the island of their birth. The moon paled fast before the rising sun. Her watch was ended and her tale was done. <laughs>